This is the Engineerathon, and it's an event where we invite uh, sixth graders from one of the local middle schools to come and get a sense and idea of what engineering and computer science is all about, uh, so that they, they can consider that as a potential area of academic focus as they move forward through middle school into high school and then into college. There's a lot of creativity here and you can there's a lot of inspiration that you can really just draw from and take all of this knowledge that has been pulled up in this really in this gym and really put your mind to something and make it something really beautiful. So they're learning how to make liquid nitrogen ice cream, they're learning how to uh, power batteries and calculators using lemons, they're learning how to clean water, so our Engineers Without Borders group is showing them how to take dirty water and using simple filtration clean that water up, and lots of other activities to ex uh, excite them, to get them interested in thinking about a career in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. I am doing this because I like to see the joy on these kids' faces when they have fun and they learn about engineering and I want these kids to be able to learn about engineering from a young age so they know what math and science can do for you and that it's not just something you learn in school, but you can actually apply it in your real life and that this is a field that you can go to when you um, go into college. The college students here are enthusiastic, they're passionate about what they do, and that's good for my students because they see people they can relate to and they can ask questions and it causes them a lot of enthusiasm. Well, I thought an engineer was someone who like built um, airplanes or buildings or big structures that are mostly what have like electronics devices with them. Now since the Engineerathon, I think that um, a engineer is someone who builds something uh, and collaborates on something in more, more likely in groups and it can be male or female. This event allows us to break stereotypes. So um, often you think about engineers and you ask a child, what's an engineer? And they may not know or they may say, oh engineers, that's the guy who builds bridges. He's the guy over there in the hard hat, right? Well now we're exposing them to women, we're exposing them to diversity, we're exposing them to say, hey, you know what, an engineer can look like me, an engineer can look like you, and to say that anybody can do this, right? If you have a passion for solving problems and wanting to make the world a better place, then engineering and computer science is, is the right place for you. Yeah, I want to be a computer engineer, so my dad's going to help me f figure out how I'm going to do that, and I'm putting my mind to it, and then you can be anything you want to be.